What's up everybody, it's Oliver here from Retro Boy and today we're going to be talking about the 5 best games that you should definitely play after watching this video. There are so many amazing games on the Game Boy Advance that many people just don't really know about because it's very easy to assume that the only good game that the Game Boy Advance has to offer is the Pokemon games. But obviously there are so many more games that are great and coming in strong on number 5 we have Advanced Wars which is the ultimate strategy game for the Game Boy Advance. This turn-based tactical gem hits all the high notes for both casual and advanced players. It's very easy to learn, but damn is it hard to master. With its simple art style and tactical gameplay, Advanced Wars lets you control terrain and outsmart opponents in your battles. And just to mention, it does have a multiplayer mode, but the way it works is that you have to plug in a cable into your friend's Game Boy Advance. But anyways, it's not a surprise that this game is still loved to this day. So if, if you like strategy games, I highly recommend it. In the number four spot, we have Fire Emblem, which is a pretty beautiful game. The thing that's special about this game is that it has the permanent death mechanic. Basically what it means is that when your character dies, you have to restart the game fully. So yeah, talk about high stakes and intense gameplay, because let's say you have a 20 hour run and you die. I mean, damn. But other than that, it has a pretty good story, memorable characters, and a few pretty decent plot twists on the way too. And for all you anime fans out there, it's anime styled, I know, absolutely amazing. I love anime, if you love anime, smash like on this video and subscribe to Retro Boy for more videos like this. At number 3 we have Metroid Fusion. Metroid Fusion has got just the right blend of exploration and dread. And what's special for this game is that the story in this game is way more structured than other Metroid games. But other people also really like this game thanks to its high paced fast action. It remains still to this day one of the most beloved entries in the Metroid franchise. At the number two spot, of course, I mean how could we not include this game? Zelda Diminish Cap. And this game has an absolutely gorgeous, smooth, mm, like like aged, fine aged wine art style. Can we not just give that a, a clap? A kapow. 10 out of 10 art style, gorgeous, I love it. In this adventure, Link gains the ability to shrink down. That's right, to shrink down. Just like my shriveled cock, which opens up a completely new world of puzzles. And it's this very shrinking mechanic that makes this game stand out out of all the others and makes it feel fresh and new even to this day. So this game is packed with charm, it has a vibrant overworld, what more could you ask for? It has the amazing shrinking mechanic. It's a 10 out of 10 for me. Please go pick it up if you haven't already. And for number one, it's Pokemon Emerald, actually. Pokemon, in my opinion, is obviously like one of the most replayable and grindy games you can get on the Game Boy. If you're the type of gamer that likes to spend a lot of time on games to fully complete them, then huh, yeah, good luck doing it on this one. If you want to complete the full franchise, you can't just have Pokemon Emerald. You need all five of the games for the Game Boy Advance, which is, let me see if I can remember, Emerald, the one that I just mentioned, Sapphire, Ruby, Fire, Red, and Leaf Green. Honestly, in my opinion, Emerald is a little bit too expensive. If you want something that's basically the same, just get Ruby or Sapphire. It's like 20 bucks cheaper. And the only difference between Emerald and Ruby and Sapphire is that there's no cool animation when you bring out the Pokemons, which a lot of people like, but I actually find it annoying. Besides that, it's basically the same game. It's just that you can't get Tyranitar for some reason. But yeah, guys, that was five of the best Game Boy Advance games. This was Oliver from Retro Boy. Make sure to smash or maybe slap that like button and subscribe button for more content from me. I just stuttered. Damn it.